Design of a Basic Pumping Facility, Raimundo Ferreira Ignacio, Class 1. Chapter 1 Basics of Hydraulics, Fluid, Concept, First Ranking, Liquids, Gases, Basic Fluid Properties, a Specific Mass, Specific Weight, Relative Specific Mass, Relative Specific Weight, Viscosity, Dynamics, Kinematics, Unity, International System, SI, Water, Viscosity, Varying, Width, Temperature, a Specific Mass, Varying, with temperature problems i chose to be educator a little of history in 1975 at the beginning of my journey as a teacher i took a distance course that was organized by cetesb he received the handouts by mail one every fortnight the handouts were typed and reproduced by the mimeograph I studied the handouts, solved the proposed problems and I sent these, also by mail for correction. Once corrected, I received them back with comments. That's how the distance learning course I took in 1975 was. Where, as I was motivated, I learned a lot. Today, 2021, is completely different. Distance learning is very close and is available 24 hours a day. You can do it online and offline. Learning is done your way and wherever you are and the best, as often as you like and all without killing any trees. Learning is up to you, but you can count on our help at any time. Just send us an email or participate in online tutoring. Design of a basic pumping facility. The objective is to propose the study in a concise, clear and simple way of the concepts information and data essential to the activity related to centrifugal pumps and pumping installations, enabling development in this area. To go deeper into a specific topic, in case of need, the student should use the complementary bibliography. Fluid it is any non-solid substance, capable of flowing out and taking the shape of the container that contains it. The first classification of fluids. Liquids and gases, with liquids having their own volume, while gases do not, as they have the same volume as the container that contains them. In this course, we will be pumping liquids. Basic properties of liquids Specific mass, rho, equals ratio between mass and volume Specific weight, gamma, equals ratio between weight and volume relationship between specific weight and specific mass gravity acceleration relative specific mass and relative specific weight when a fluid flows there is a relative movement between its particles resulting in friction between them And what is this friction? Internal friction or viscosity, Mi, is the property of fluids responsible for their resistance to flow. The relationship between the viscosity, Mi, and the specific mass, Rho, of the fluid is called kinematic viscosity, Ni. When we talk about pumping installation design, particularly in the initial data, we consider the fluid and its flow temperature, as this temperature influences its properties. But in hydraulic projects, where we usually work with water, it is not common to consider the specific mass, rho, equal to 1000 kg per cubic meter, the viscosity, mi, equal to 10 to the minus 3 pascal times a second and the kinematic viscosity, ni, 
equal to 10 to the minus 6 square meters per second? True, but when researching the dependence of water on temperature, we get It is important to make the decision of what to use, but I would like to propose problems to finish our first class, and remember, it is through them that we perform brain muscle training in order to increase intelligence. First, considering equation 1 and the viscosity value equal to 10 raised to minus Pascal times a second, calculate the water temperature. Second, considering equation 2 and the specific mass value equal to 1000 kilograms per cubic meter, calculate the water temperature. Third, reflect on the previous two answers. Synthesizing what we study in class 1. Let's keep applying what we've learned. 4. Show the difference between the weight, g, calculated with a g equals 10 meters per square second and the g specified as a function of latitude and altitude. Considering a body with a mass equal to 80 kilograms in Sao Paulo, latitude equals minus 23.5505 degrees and altitude equals 760 meters, and in La Paz, latitude equals minus 16.5 degrees and altitude equals 3,782 meters. Mass, m, is a characteristic property of the body and specifies its amount of matter, which can be considered constant, while the weight, g, which is defined as a function of mass and acceleration due to gravity, changes depending on the location considered. This is because the acceleration of gravity changes with altitude and latitude. Equation extracted from the book. Manual of Hydraulics, 8th edition. Azevedo Neto, page 7. Answer. G with G equal to 10 meters per square second equals 800 newton and G with a acceleration calculated in Sao Paulo equals 782.90 newton. G with the calculated acceleration at La Paz equals 781.82 Newton. So there is a difference in the order of 2.3%. Fifth. A glycerin reservoir has a mass of 1450 kg and a volume of 1189.5 liters. Determine in the SI the weight, specific weight, specific mass and relative specific mass of glycerin, given g equals 9.8 meters per second squared. Response. Sixth, ethyl alcohol has a relative specific mass equal to 0.79 and will be stored in a conical reservoir. Knowing that, due to space limitations, the height of the cone will be 5 meters, specify its approximate radius knowing that it will store 16.5 tons of ethyl alcohol. Response 7. A liquid aluminum sulfate solution has a relative specific mass equal to 1.328. Calculate a, the total mass of this solution inside a reservoir that contains 255 cubic meters of it. b. 
the specific gravity of the aluminum sulfate at a location with the acceleration of gravity equal to 9.8 m per square second? Answers. 338,640 kg and 13,014.4 n per cubic meter. 8. A 42,875 liters cubic reservoir open to the atmosphere has three-fifths of its capacity filled by a liquid with a relative specific mass equal to 0.82. Specify the mass of the liquid in this situation in the SI. Answer. M equals 21,094.5 kg. 9. The figure on the side shows a water reservoir in the form of a straight circular cylinder, 6 meters high. When it is completely full, the reservoir is enough to supply, for a day, 900 houses whose consumption per house is 500 liters of water. Knowing that it is located in the city of Amparo, which has an acceleration of gravity approximately equal to 9.8 meters per square second. We ask, the approximate diameter of the base of the reservoir and the weight that the total volume of water exerts on the base of the reservoir. Data. Specific mass of water equals 1,000 kg per cubic meter. Solution can be seen in the video. Last. Find the mass and height of the free surface of a volume of 22.7 liters of water that is placed in a conical tank 508 millimeters high, with a base radius equal to 254 millimeters. Also specify the volume of additional water and the corresponding weight that is required to completely fill the tank. Solution can be seen in the video. Only advance in the course. After solving the 10 proposed problems, remember, obtaining your solutions is gymnastics for your brain in order to increase your intelligence. I am waiting.